next match. On to our next up. match here, and this is going to be a good one. Pugsy and Kui versus Cake and Addy Mestic, of More. course. Cake and Addy Mestic, the only European team to win a world championship. Also, they are the most recent 2v2 world champions. Definitely juggernauts in their own right, but they're gonna be going against Kui and Pugsy. Now, Pugsy's been on a tear, man. This has been this has been like the best tournament of his life, I feel yep. like, in terms of performance. F forget placements. I mean, maybe even placements. I don't know the data. Oh, he's, but he's giving, he's but giving in terms of performance, man, he's been playing so well yesterday and today. Yep that I would not be surprised if these guys could take out these previous world champions. I'm very And then excited. you got Kui, man. Kui, after CEO, he's just a total monster. Yep. Uh, what's he playing in 2v? Is he, does he also play Asuri in 2v2? Probably. I've yet to actually... He, I, I love it yeah. because he, they've, they've got Gimp potential. Yeah. I know that Pugsy's going to be paying, playing more of that Jala, so meaning that we get to see a little bit of Jala earlier on with Daikyu and now a completely different flavor. Of Jala gameplay coming into Oh, check game out these stats. Number one. Okay, let's hold on to these stats for a second. Look at this. Look at this. Don't look at Kui's rankings, though. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> hey, they're only going up after today, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. For sure. These, these guys, all those guys' data is going to be going up there for sure. We're recapping what happened. He's like, dude, I, dude, I had him. And then, you know. I just can't, I can't imagine what he's saying. Here comes Coach Creed to let him know what actually went wrong. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we get our button remapping. in. All right, totally biased opinion. Who do you think is going to win? Who do you think's gonna win? I think I think I think Pugsy. Pugsy and Kui? Yeah. No, not not Kui, just Pugsy. Oh, just Pugsy. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I think Pugsy's on such fire that even if Kui dies, it just doesn't matter, dude. He's gonna go he's gonna go off with this Jala. I don't know, when Cake brings out the two speed Queen Knight, that's when I know that something's gonna Oh, go dude, okay, all right. Well if if Cake plays two speed Queen Knight, then I take it back, you know. There's nothing that they're going to be able to do to counter that. Oh, there's a two-speed queen eye for the button <laughs> check. But it's just a sure. button check. It's just a button check. We don't really know. Just watch. Watch the graceful aerial movement of a queen eye on two-speed. <laughs> He's making it look pretty fast. Oh, my gosh. That's so slow. That's so slow. It's so slow. <laughs> 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 so I had no idea. <laughs> Yeah, and so the wow. problem with that, now even though you can dash and stuff on stage, the problem is air speed, right? Because look at this, right? If he, if he's, you see how slow he went off yeah. stage? Like, like he, even on small Brawl Haven, if he gets knocked out and doesn't like, like knocked off the stage but not knocked out, he actually might not be able to make it back without an assist from Addy Vestic. So it's understandable why he wouldn't want to play something like that. Oh, we're getting a, another, another button, button check. check. Yeah, double, they double literally check. opened up the. Uh, then name your name your your character screen so that they can say I'm not done. <laughs> so they can go back into the play. <laughs> so they're making sure that everything's working out pretty fine. Yeah, you know what? Get yeah, get it done. Do what you need to do. Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. Did that th did that start menu come up because they pressed the Windows key? Hundred percent. No. Hundred percent. No no no, we we disable the Windows key. If that's not set, we need to fix that right now. Guys, I need to know. Oh. As the tech support for this tournament. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's find out. Let's find out. Just press the press a Windows key. See if it comes up. Slap a Windows key real quick. There's other ways to do it, like control escape. Oh, you know what probably happened is escape is the button to bring up the pause menu. And if any other person was holding control at the time for whatever reason, like Okay. Well, I was just exp I was I was just explaining why it came up toast in in, in my ears. <laughs> okay, it's fine. Don't even worry about it, guys. <laughs> false alarm. False alarm. The toast in my ears. It's literally. Toast, toast is like whispering in our ears while we're while we're casting, guys. <laughs> I just like to, I just like to think that it's actually pieces of toast that are just stuck in our ears. <laughs> There's it's toast like, oh, in my gosh. ear. <laughs> 
All right. So these are the real picks here. Kate going with Xavier Woods, an epic crossover for Bode Bar. Addy Mesta going with Petra, who's been his new pick since Low Tier City, since after Low Tier City. And we've got, oh, Kui's playing Hattori. I thought, I thought that Kui would be playing uh, Asuri like he was in CEO, but this might be his 2v2 character. And I get it. Sword's great for 2v2. Hattori's Look also at like this. the This 2v2. is top eight graphic stuff right here. That's right. We're in top eight, ladies and gentlemen. It's going down right now. Cake and Addy Mestic versus Pugsy and Kui. How's this going to go? We got Pugsy on the Jala. So much Jala representation in this top eight so far. Can Pugsy continue moving forward as we opening up on Mammoth Fortress? Nice Sarah to Addy super early on. And immediately Ooh. turning around to get that Ooh. team combo into the neutral sig un So much damage. Cake really What a great way to open it up. That's, that's, that's like a mental advantage, too. They're like, oh, yeah, we can just 2v1 combo these guys, even while the other guy is available to interrupt it. Ooh, but Kui got set flying Yeah, by Cake. unfortunately. It might not be that easy. Oh, nice one by Pugsy. Reverse Sarah on his way back up to the stage. Here comes the combo. Oh, no. Kui missed it. Yeah, Kui's, Kui's punching a little bit low for that. A one. little bit low. If he had a weapon, maybe one of the signatures would have gone. Oh, yeah, like a Tori neutral sig would have been perfect. Here we go. More combo action. Oh, man, these guys. They got, the, they got the, their combos down. OK, another point for Kui and Pugsy. Whoa, now Eddie, they're in the lead. Can he use the neutral light on Kui to reposition to continue the combo onto Pugsy? Bring him up into the deep red. Almost being able to take him off the top. Oh no, there goes Pugsy. Can Kui follow shortly afterwards? Cake does not get the team combo off. Then the weapon toss actually interrupts the side stick from Addy, but the kick comes in. Is Kui going down? Oh, Pugsy goes down. Okay, no, Kui makes it back. And Cake is now fighting off stage against the unarmed Pugsy. And oh all the my goodness, are Pugsy's got to go around to the other side. That was too much. And what happened to Kui? Kui's down. That's that's unfortunate because that's a pretty significant lead that they're losing right there. Kui lands a nice downlight but gets interrupted by Addy Mestic. Now Pugsy down to his final stock. Addy Mestic and Cake look poised to win this game. But anything can happen still. We've seen come back greater than this. Kui went down for that ground pound neutral. Puts Pugsy off to the right. Sometimes we see player go for like predictive ground pounds like there was nobody really there but yeah. if he you know if the guy just like recovered at the wrong time or jumped then then they'd catch him so it was a it didn't look like he was going for anything but it was safe and could have been something good oh pugsy going for a huge Ooh. play and it gets reversed on him luckily he gets a hit now and is able to chase dodge his way back up onto the stage Pugsy getting knocked around. Kui as well. Everybody on the stage extremely damaged. And there goes Kui. It's up to Pugsy now. All right. I called it before. I'm telling you. Pugsy's going to handle this just fine. Oh, man. That oh, no. Light. Now he's disarmed. Oh. oh, no. I'm wrong. Addy Mexican Cake. The, the current world champions. You should not expect any less. Yeah, doing a great job finishing off that stock. And that, and that is a skill that Cake and Addy have had man, many, many months they've, to practice. Look, they've it's, teamed, it's cleaning out a 2v1. Yeah, they've teamed together so long that they don't even need to talk to each other. They speak telepathically. It's like Addy Messick's got his microphone up. Cake's listening to music. Still, still they communicate fine somehow. I guess after two and a half years of playing 2v2 together, you get that kind of synergy. Ooh, and Kui missing into down light ground pound on the cake for some early damage. And Kate gets straight in. Down air is Pugsy out of the way so that Kui can focus on to Addy Mestic. Down light side air puts Addy off the right side of the stage. And Kate, what? Ooh. Uh, that side stick was aiming for Kate. I, I, mean, I mean, for Addy Mestic, that was, was crazy. Stop stomp side air, not picked up by Addy Mestic. And so many, there's, Ooh, there's so Kate many. Ooh, with the save. There's so many team combo ideas between these two teams. Yeah. They're just barely being missed by the fact that the other team is interfering. Yeah. Yeah, we've been seeing that happen a lot. Oh, man, that side stick came so close. Stops there. It's going to be enough for Pugsy. Kui getting that nice side stick onto Cake. And Addy and Kui now fighting off stage for each other's lives. Pogo stick, weapon toss, not enough. Doesn't Ooh. matter. Addy messed it down. He had, like, no recovery options left. He just, he just fell like a rock. And now Kui's the only player left on the field with all three of his stocks. Cake trying to <laughs> trying to change that real quick. It's a slide kick, ground pound, a lot of damage on that move. I wonder if it would have KO'd if he did a gravity cancel neutral signature. Kui's still alive, but look how much damage Pugsy is taking in the meantime. 
Ooh, oh my goodness, another team there. combo on Pugsy. And the weapon tosses begin. <laughs> Nair and hit. Pugsy goes for that axe. Downer does not connect on stop stairs. There goes Pugsy, Pugsy and, and the recovery. at the same time. Okay, so there's the, it's, it's a dangerous balance of a lead right here because by numbers, red team is in the lead, but Yeah, damage, but they could both go down at the same time, basically. Kui's, Kui being so fresh on this second stock is the advantage that blue team has. So hopefully he can keep that up. And score a KO here. Addy Messi trying to come back to the stage. Oh, they got both of them now. All right, there goes Addy. Can they get Keiko? Weapon Toss came so close to taking off this is, Oh, this is such a good position for Kui and Pugsy. Ooh, Every Kui. time this, this happens with these guys, they always come out on top, man. Oh, man. Kui only in the orange as Double. well. Pugsy's barely taking any damage. Addy Mestic is starting to get hit by that satellite. Did not lead it to a nair. Accidentally neutralized Pugsy. Down air. Addy Mestic off the left side of the stage. Recovers Kui, but Kui still on two stocks. That scoop's not going to be nearly enough to be able to take him off the top. And Pugsy. Avoids that side air recovery, hits him up, and now Cake down to one stock. Addy Mestic potentially just out. Ah, uh, but Pugsy's got to be careful. Oh, Addy's taking so much damage. Can Addy even make it back? He has to stare all the way through. Cooey gets him. Cake has to save. Okay, there's there the recovery. There it is. Nice save. Good call out. All right, Pugsy. Pugsy's looking to make a play here as he is on his final oh, oh, no! They've ended that quickly. All right, this is not unfeasible for Cooey. Addy Messick, one good hit away from death, and then it's a 1v1 against an amazing player like Cake. Totally doable for Pukui. Let's see if he can do this. One stop there, starts to attack on the damage. Silent Sider as well. Addy and Cake are both just going to be covering every piece of the stage that Kui can be yeah. landing onto and then getting those nice combo starters. Ooh. Like, look at that. Whoa. That's Man, so much damage. they're so good at that. Uh-oh. <gasps> he just uh -oh. Addy. Addy. So terrifying. He's coming back. All right, he's fine. Like that cider was so oh, out now of Kui without a weapon leaves him in a tough oh. spot. Oh man! Neutralite into neutral signature. Cake takes him down and secures a 2-0 lead over Pugsy and Kui. Are both Jalas gonna be out at seven? Oh no! <laughs> Can't lose all of our Jalas. It's funny because it <laughs> what? kind of sounds like dollars. <laughs> 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 I don't know why I thought that way. It's like can't lose. The we can't lose dollars. all of these Jalas. We need at least one. All right. Character has not seen that much in competitive play. Game three, Cake and Addy Mestic just need one more game to move on to the next round. Oh, they're so close, too. It, it's interesting to, to me to consider that Cake is playing Xavier Woods, which is both far and two yeah. for as long as he is, and still doing so well. Cake's hammer isn't something that I'm too used to seeing being used primarily, but it, he's yeah. doing phenomenally with He's it. got pancake power. That's all he needs. That's all he needs. All anybody needs, really. Oh, Pugsy's really hurting so far at the beginning of this match, but Addy Messick hurting even more. Cider takes him off that right side of the stage, almost, I think, like right as he got into red. Pugsy okay. off the stage. He's trying to recover. He doesn't have a weapon, and oh, Kate perfect. grabs him with a with a hammer recovery, knocking him down. Addy Messick finishing off Kui at the same time. Addy Messick and Cake are that much closer to moving on to the next round. Who do they face if they win this? Faison, Faison and Remy. And Remy. Kui goes for that ground pound. Cake follows up that downer. No side up the recovery connects, and he picks up the hammer into a neutral light, going all the way for that recovery. Kui's dodges down, and he ground pounds straight into Pugsy. Side light hits an Addy mess to continue the combo within his own side light. That side sick punish, but no stock lost just yet. Cake stock tanking like a champ. Ooh, avoids that down light from Pugsy. And Addy Mestic sets wow. super high. Lucky to be alive as he caught that down light recovery off the top platform. That's like as high as he could be to land that move. Oh, but it's a very perfect. high ceiling on this stage. And now Kui down to his final stock, and Cake hasn't even lost Dude, one. Pugsy might be down it's to his looking last stock really too. It good. Is. Addy makes it back as well. What? Five stocks to two now, four to two. Kui can even up nice. really quickly. That's a, but is exactly okay. what needed to happen. They, this is totally possible for Pugsy and Kui, but they got to make a huge play here as Cake is fresh on two stocks. Ooh, Pugsy has stared Kui twice now into the orange, and Addy Messick just tags on a little bit more damage as Pugsy really just trying to do as much damage to Cake as he can at the expense of his teammates' HP. Oh, and Kui now down at the bottom of the stage. Can Addy Mess get the ground pound? Doesn't even need to. Kui falls, and at now Pugsy is stuck in the 1v2 of the lifetime. Now ground pound connects. Can Cake make it back? He can nice. not. Nice! All the way down. Can he get Ooh. Addy as well? Addy Mess not okay. even risking going off Pugsy, stage. Pugsy, he's got to play the stock of his life right here. Ooh, that's And he lost his flying. weapon. Oh, man, it's so hard to deal with the two when you got no weapon, and this could be it right here. Pugsy, Sarah that's it. it. Addy Messick and Cake win 3-0 against Pugsy and Kui.
What a game. Against our expectations. That's for Definitely sure. Definitely against my expectations. Kaken That's my bad. Have I should have believed in them. Severely. And now they are 3-0 over Pugsy and Kui and going up against Faison and Remy. So who do we got coming up next? So in winners finals, Boomy and Sandstorm and Wrench and Cosplays are waiting. And in losers quarters finals, we have Faison and Remy versus Cake and Addy Mystic. It's going to be Ethan, Ethan and, and Noel, Noel versus Little Captain Ithro. Little Captain Ithro. I see him. I'm like, I'm making it.